woken up, hoping I was having a reoccurring nightmare. We spent more than 36 hours earlier today relocating our campsite closest to our good site, only to be ambushed by local wildlife that's hungry coming out of hibernation. Half of my staff was eaten alive, or killed by skags. I survived by hiding under a colleague of mine who was being devoured on top of me. His name was Carl. My emotions are deadened, and I grieve for none of them. Point of fact, the only emotion I felt was that of joy. I felt joy because his chair was always more comfortable than mine. I took his chair, and then I noticed the emissive glow on the rocks at the dig site. the medical equipment working, morally, 
Is there something you need? Oh, I'm not much for compliments, but you did fine. Oh, I'm not much for compliments, but you did fine. I sat in the shower in tears for just under an hour. This is interesting, considering we haven't had water for days. I equate my ever-decreasing sanity with that of the population of my dig site. With the investigation of the symbols and glowing patterns at the site, we finally unearthed arguably certifiable proof of the existence of alien life having been here on Pandora. But this celebration was lonely, as I only have two colleagues left. And I'm not too fond of the fat girl, Shimei. I've been told that scientific discovery requires sacrifice, but I never understood what they meant until now. Thank you. 